Now I'd just like to run through our electric net product. Our netting, as you see, is all green. It's all 1,200 mil high, so which is 1.2 metres. The difference for most nets on the market compared to ours, ours has a unique feature, which we believe is great. Inserted in each of our posts is a 7 mil fiberglass rod. With the true history and proving with other, I suppose, experimenting with other nets, found with the post, because of the nature of the post, once they bend, you get wind, you get sunshine, very hot weather on them. Once the pressure's on them, they tend to stay in that situation. So what we've come up with is a fiberglass rod. Simple solution to keeping your post straight. So fiberglass, naturally, no matter how much you bend it, will always come back to the straight position. For example, you think of a fishing rod. Right, you're catching a 20 kilo fish on your fishing rod. What happens to your rod? It bends. What happens when it's caught? Your rod goes back to the same situation. Same with our post. So whatever you do with your post, no matter how much you bend it, it will always come back to the straight position. It's a very good feature with ours and we think it's a fantastic thing. All our nets have double prong at the bottom. So either way, hit it in. If you want single prong, it's just a matter of simple cut off with the grinder. Like if you're in rocky areas, you find you have trouble getting the two prongs in. Just run your grinder through, you've got your single prong post. So best of both worlds. Our nets come in both 25 and 50 metre, um, 50 metre lengths. We also have solar energizers to run the nets. So it's quite a simple setup, as you can see. Your netting just goes here. You hook onto your galvanised post for your earth and straight onto your net for your um, for your energizer, which then will liven up the net. Now, as you can see, with all the corners, the corner here, and we just walk along here and just come down to this one. You can see that um, it's imperative to keep your net nice and tight and strength. So what we highly recommend is in each corner, you use a star picket, or you do get supplied with pegs in the um, in the kit, but we just find a star picket a little bit better. And just a little rope, just to tie it, just to keep everything nice and straight and flexible. And then you won't have a problem of your net sagging, falling, and so on. So it's fairly straightforward how to operate it all. And once again, it just comes back to doing it, it's common sense, if you have your net set up properly, you won't lose a bird. The other feature by having this net with our sheds in, we never ever lock our birds up. So when we look at our shed over there, with that flap, where the chooks go in and out, they always stay down. The bird goes to bed when it wants to, it gets up when it wants to, it lays when it wants to, so there's no thing. And it's that simple. And the birds are so much happier. And uh, so yeah, so by having this net, you won't have a problem. So at the end of the day, if you're going to have one of our sheds, you, it's just, you must have a net and then you will not have a problem. Everything will work great. But as I said, our nets are available, they're all 1.2 and our little feature, which we're very happy about, we're the only ones with it, very unique. And as you can see, it always comes back to the straight position. All right, thanks for your time.